Hi folks, Mary Scott here from Wealth With Passion and another great day here. And my topic for today is gratitude and what does gratitude mean to you? Um, it, a lot of talk about gratitude out there in the workforce, out there in the world today, lots probably a little bit overdone. However, I think that it's easy to overlook um, just having gratitude for everyday things in your life. I know sometimes I, I have to check myself, you know, what am I grateful for? And as you can see behind me, I've got some beautiful palms and, you know, my environment is just gorgeous where I live. Lots and lots to be, to be grateful for. Uh, what is it they say? An attitude of gratitude. And it, it certainly, I think it really makes an impact on your life if you really start to understand this whole thing of um, accepting and acknowledging gratitude or, or being grateful. Lots of this, well, over the years, I've noticed there's quite a bit of negative connotations, you know, why should I be grateful? I've heard that kind of thing. However, I think, however, I, I think it's worth just considering about your life and are you grateful for, for just what you have? Are you grateful for where you're at uh, today in your life, your environment, the, the friendships that you have? Um, you know, for me, what, uh, what stands out straight away, of course, is I'm grateful for being able to work from home. It's been such a bonus to just... Uh, to work from home and be grateful for every day when I wake up and I jump out of bed, because you all know I'm enthusiastic because I, I really have quite a deep passion for life. So um, last year I did, and I, I just thought I'd show you, I had this, you know, gratitude journal, writing and creativity journal, gratitude. And oh, I got really stuck into it and I did it every day. And, you know, I just realized that even though I don't write in that journal every day, I really am grateful every day. Uh, I have a lot of appreciation. I don't know whether it's something to do with my age uh, to having a deeper appreciation. So my challenge, uh, I love to challenge you out there, out there in the global space of... Uh, uh, all around the world, just to, you know, check your gratitude levels. I'm sure it makes a difference to your health. I'm sure if I went on Google, I'd find some scientific evidence to say that being grateful enhances your your life expectancy by 10% or something like that. I don't know. I'm just making that up. But, you know, attitude of gratitude, be grateful. Uh, my mother used to say, be grateful for your small blessings. Well, I'd have, look, I think there's plenty of blessings, small, big, uh, whatever. So what are you grateful for? Your family, people that love you. Wow, it's even Valentine's Day in this part of the world. So that will mean something to some of you and others may not. So I'll leave you with that thought, attitude of gratitude. Uh, I'm grateful for today. I'm grateful for your feedback and grateful for people watching. So what is it? Be awesome. Be positive. Bye-bye.